My people, what's up? This Joe Crizzle. All praise to the Most High, Yahweh, Yahweh Shah. Hey, y'all, y'all check this out, man. Um, I'm about to talk about uh, ARA. Uh, compared to compare with uh, Bitwig and Studio One. Um, and this is for people that deal with audio and engineers, and you people pay you to record a music. And you're serious about getting things done. So everybody know what um, the Melodon is, the pitch correction. Been around for years and it's, and how important it is when you're dealing with people that really can't sing as good. Or even if they can sing good, sometimes singers still be off note. Or you can perfect the note to make it even better than what the, what it already was. And that's a fact. Um, and um, time is money. So when you're in a session and you're doing business and you're recording, even if you're doing yourself, it's very important to have simplicity when it comes to certain uh, things, right? So I'm going to show you all. So as you can see right here, this is a song, right? And let's say you mixing this song down and you want to pitch correct these vocals. So let me play this song back first. Yo, I only wanna have sex with you, with you. Yo, I only wanna have sex. That's all, that's all. Yo, I only wanna have sex with you, with you. Yo, I only wanna have sex. That's all, that's all. Nice honey bun on my platter with the mean fork. But anyway, it ain't it ain't really makes it, it that's that's all raw. Um now let's say each one of these tracks right here, let me highlight these. This is the hook. Yo, I only wanna have sex. With you, with you, yo, I only wanna So, I do got a delay on it I ain't even, I forgot that song there um, And let's say I gotta pitch correct all these Because, it, you know, you want them to sound right So, what I would have to do in, in uh, Since uh, Bitwig is not compatible with ARA I have to go on the track I have to put in put uh, pull in Melodon, right? Um, now, as you know, it loads loads up. It's gonna pop up. Now, on this pop up part right here, when a door like this compatible with ARA, uh, actually Cockers Bit Cockers Reaper is compatible with it. All these right here would be on this track, or they they will already be in here. You'll see it. You get what I'm saying? You'll see it. But as you can see, it's nothing in here. So what I have to do, I have to literally press transfer, and I have to record each one of these in, each one of these in right here. Yeah, and that's some, yeah. Come on, think about it. So I have to Yo, I only wanna have sex. With you, with you, yo, I only wanna have sex. That's all, that's all. Yo, I only wanna have sex. With you, with you, yo, I only wanna have sex. That's all, that's all. Nice honey bun on my. Right? So I, I gotta record that one then. I gotta go to the next one. Press transfer and uh press play. Do is won't check. So I only wanna have sex with you, with you. Yo, I only wanna have sex. That's all, that's all. Yo, I only wanna have sex with you, with you. Yo, I only wanna have sex. Why I only just won't. All right, so now I have to do that with 
every track. Look, no one got time for that shit. Not 2019, man. I mean, don't get me wrong. If you don't got no other options, you got to do what you got to do. Because, you know, back in the day when I was recording artists, it's a lot of things we had to do. Even when you go back before that, doing uh, when they was recording on eight tracks and stuff like that, artists had to literally record all the way through on a two track without messing up to get their song done. Like, literally. They have to go all the way from the beginning to the end without stopping and hope that everything is perfected. And artists right now, they make it so easy where you can just go step by step, step by step, build, build, build. That's a big ass work ethic. Trust me. That's why a lot of old school artists feel some kind of way about new artists certain days. But at the end of the day, man, time change, get with the program. But um, so that's what you got to do, man. It's just that simple. You you have to whatever you have to do to perfect it. You have to do every one of these tracks because these are the same notes. You singing the same thing, you know. Uh, sometimes you don't got to do every track. You could do the lead vocals and then kind of like you know smooth these out, lower them down, and and kind of like put them in the back, you know. But like I say, then if you want to, if you doing the vocals and that person harmonizing, or even if you know anything. If you want to time stretch something to move it a certain way, then you you gotta you gotta perfect these vocals and, and tweak them up when they especially R and B artists, anybody that sings, that has some type of notes or anything. All right, so now um, let me see, make sure. So that's when you don't support ARA, and that's crazy. That's a deal breaker. All right, so now let me let me close this. Let me close this. I'm going to go in the song in Studio One. See, it say AR, plug-in support. And at the end of the day, it's, you know, this is not important to, I guess, producers. Uh, I'm a producer. It's important to me. When I deal with audio, because I'm a, I started off as an artist, and I record artists, I mix and master artists, and I, I get paid for it. So I don't got time for all the, the you know the, the, uh, the bull crap. I, I want to get stuff done. Um, okay, so let me find a song. I think it's a young boy John I had did. Uh, Matter of fact, I'm not going to play this. I don't know if he want this play right now. Let me see. see. Yeah, this is going to crack because that that, that daggone sound card, the record these videos ain't. The sample rate is weird. Let me let me grab this. This I beat. I put a hook on. It don't have too many plugins. Myself a star. Uh, let me see. Play this back. Shit, be cracking because it ain't even shooting up. They say the young boy wanna be a star. Anyway, uh, yeah, this is gonna crack too. But any, okay. So now, same thing. I got these vocals, right? This is the hook, and all I gotta do in Studio One, highlight all these, right click. Matter of fact, hold on. What the hell I'm doing? Alright, right click, go to audio, go to edit Melodyne. Well, I could have just pressed control M.
Now watch it do its work. Close this. Every one have it already on there, ready, cock loading, ready. So all I gotta do is just click on this one, tweak it. There you go. They all right there. That's it. It's just that simple. It's, it's, it's nothing else to explain. Like this is a deal breaker when you you dealing with artists who love to record a lot of tracks. They love to perfect how they manipulate things. Now, if you're dealing with an artist, they come in, they do like three, four tracks, five. The vocals is one track. The lead vocals, the hook, only one track with the auto tune on it or something like that. You know, they all probably got like one track of ad libs and you know, and keep it simple, like. How Jay-Z rap Jay-Z don't put a lot of stuff on his vocals To each his own Now if you're dealing with a rapper like Kendrick Lamar I think he really perfect a lot Craft in the studio when he recording And Both is dope Sometimes songs tell you a different thing to do But Like I say If you're dealing with an artist That That record a lot of tracks And you working in a door that don't support A.R.A. And you got mellow die. I feel sorry for you. Uh, look, I, I look. I wish I can give it to you, straight up. But um, everybody not fortunate to get mellow die. I get it. You know that's why some people use uh, Cubase. You got very, you got very. I think it's called Vera Audio or something like that. Sampler Two has it built in theirs. It, it, for the young boys who don't know, Magic Sampler Two. That's a a powerful, powerful recording DAW. It's just ugly as hell. Uh, been around for years. Uh, Sonar got this support Melodon, the integrated Melodon, the ARA. And I think it have its own uh, pitch thing also. Um, Reaper support ARA. And Reaper not even big, bigger than Big Wig. And with Reaper, as soon as you drop the plug in on the uh soon yeah, as soon as you drop the plug in on the on the the vocals, it just pulls everything in and just just that fast. Reasons, reasons have its own uh audio detect uh pitch correction. It pops up. Um Pro Tools, I gotta check. I don't I don't know if Pro Tools, I think I don't know for sure if Pro Tools has it. Uh not for sure yet. But I, uh, Logic, I don't know for sure if Logic has it. I got to check. Um, FL Studio. FL Studio, don't do it. No, it don't do it at all. Um, what's another program? I think, I think that's, I think that's, uh, uh, GarageBand. I don't know, but anyway, you you have to read up about them and check it up, uh, and and this is to help my people, man. That's it, you know. Don't get on here in your feelings about what's better and what's not better. Come on, man. Y'all do this all the time. Just this is just to give you information, so you don't spend money on a doll and realize it wasn't worth it. Yeah, they give you the demos. Some place, some companies give you demos. And sometimes they don't provide everything in the demo. I think Reaper the only one that give you the full demo. And you don't want to waste your money, man. When you when, when time is money and you, you, you're trying to perfect your craft. This show Crizzle. If you have any other questions, subscribe me. Peace. Hey,